Good day everyone. Welcome to Teacher Julie channel. Hello everyone. We have our new lesson in Science 7 which is all about the stages of mitosis. This will be the second quarter topic and learning competency number 5. This lesson is under the Matatag curriculum. For the objectives, by the end of the lesson, 80% of the learners will be able to first is to define what is mitosis. The second one is to model the stages of mitosis using visual aid or hands-on activities. And the third one is to appreciate the mitosis by creating a physical representation of stages of mitosis. In activating the prior knowledge, the teacher will present the pictures and let the students answer the process questions. In establishing purpose of the lesson for unlocking of content vocabulary, the teacher will use the match type activity. The cell cycle is the name we give to the mechanism by which cells multiply and make new cells. The two major stages in the cell cycle are interphase and the cell division or the mitotic phase. Interphase is the period between mitotic division that is G1, S, and G2. The stage where the cell prepares to divide is the G1. It then goes into the S phase where all the DNA is copied by the cell. So S stands for the synthesis of the DNA. The cell moves into the G2 phase where it organizes and condenses the genetic material or begin to condense the genetic material and prepares to divide after the DNA is copied and there is a full extra collection of all of the genetic material. M is the next stage. M stands for the mitosis. This is where the two copies of the genetic material partitioned into two daughter cells by the cell. Cell division happens after the M step is completed and two cells are left and the cell cycle will begin again. If a cell is fully developed, it will either stop growing or divides and produces more cell through cell division. Cell division in your body helps to expand and fix worn out tissues. Division can also lead to an increased number of cells growing. There are two types of division of cells, the mitosis and the meiosis. Mitosis, it happens in somatic or the body cells, while the meiosis happens in germ cells that give rise to the gametes or sex cells, for example, the egg and the sperm cells. The completion of the entire cycle varies depending upon the cell type. Some cells complete the cycle within a few minutes, others after several hours or even a year, and after 12 to 14 hours in your body, most cells divide. Mitosis is a form of cell division that produces two daughter cells having the same genetic material as its parent. The first stage of mitosis is the prophase. This phase 
occupies over half of the mitosis. The cell prepares for cell division by copying the DNA and the nuclear membrane and the nucleolus are starting to break down in this process. So chromatin condenses into chromosomes. So a centromer binds the double-stranded chromosome together at one point and spindle fiber began to form which are microscopic protein structure that helps divide the genetic material in the cell. The second stage of mitosis is the metaphase. At the equator of the cell, the now double-stranded chromosomes called the chromatids align themselves. Each chromatid is connected to the spindle by the structure called the kinetochore in the centromer. The third stage of mitosis is what we call the anaphase. This is the shortest stage. The chromatids are pushed by forces originating from the pools to pass. Consequently, the centromer divides into new single-stranded chromosomes, splitting the chromatids. After that, the chromosomes travel towards their respective pools. The fourth step of mitosis is the telophase. This is the final mitosis step. The opposite pools have now reached the chromosome and the spindle is vanishing. The chromosome now uncoil at the pools and the nucleolus and the nuclear membrane start to reform. The cytoplasm simultaneously divide and the cell is separated into two by a plasma membrane. The formation of the new plasma membrane completely divides the cell into two identical daughter cells. The creation of a cleavage furrow in the animal cells is necessary for cytokinesis where the cytoplasm divides and the parent cells become two daughter cells. It pinches the cell off or splits into two. In plant cells, cells do not pinch off. Instead, between the two nuclei, a new cell wall called the cell plate forms. For the lesson activity, the students will answer the mitosis in motion and then the students will simulate the stages of mitosis using everyday objects to illustrate the process.